Hey everyone, this is Shane, the building biologist. I've got an interesting one for you in this video in terms of uh, sources of EMF that you might not think of, might not be on the lookout for, but that are every bit as important to find because they can um, present a radiation exposure into your home that is going to impact your health. And, you know, when we're talking about AC magnetic fields, a very common type of EMF, we're usually seeing it from power lines or from like a motor in a blender or a fan in your furnace uh, or even wiring errors from the wires inside your walls for the electrical system. Um, those are all fairly obvious. We've heard a lot about those. But uh, this is actually one that might surprise you. And we're looking right now at a marker for a gas pipeline. And it's just warning people that there's a buried pipeline here and, you know, not to dig or just to be aware of it for, for safety. There's another one up there which shows us the path of this gas pipeline. But the interesting thing here is that the gas companies actually inject a little bit of electrical current onto the casing of the pipe to um you know to to do a few things but mainly for safety to help with uh explosion fire risk that kind of thing and so anytime we have current flow we're going to have a magnetic field and the question is how much how big how close does it get to our house so i just want to show you um after that setup you know we're just out here kind of on a gravel road, no power lines or anything. Uh, the magnetic field is pretty low. This is actually really great if your house is this low. We're less than 0.2 milligauss, 15 nano Tesla here. So as we get a little bit closer, however, to this where this pipeline runs, you're gonna see what happens on the meter. Okay, we're climbing up to 0 0.3, 0 0.4, 0.5, almost 0.6. So it's it's starting to run kind of in this path down the road. But we're almost to a milligauss here. And, you know, if this was close to your home, this could be a significant factor to take into account in trying to rid yourself of EMF exposures. So just uh, wanted to let you all know about this type of EMF hazard. Hope you found this helpful. Definitely subscribe. To the channel click the notification button so that you don't miss the other tips and tricks that i will reveal from time to time take care